Hey, what's up, everybody? Shay Styles here. You're such a friend of the mister, and you are watching Disney Channel. Welcome back to my channel, everybody. Y'all, I made an oopsie. So yesterday or the day before, I recorded a video. Literally the video that you're watching, but this is version two. So version one is lost to 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 the recycling bin. Well, past the recycling bin because I deleted it. I'm trying to recover it, but I was like, you know what? This update is literally going to be Wednesday. So I'm 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 over trying to recover it at this point. If I can recover it, I will put the original video on my channel. And if y'all want to watch that, y'all can. I'm so mad. I spent four hours editing that video. Three hours and some change editing it. Maybe about another hour and some change making the thumbnail. The same thumbnail that I'm using for this one, but you know. Anyway, so <laughs> I'm just going to cut to the change. And, and I might not sound as excited, but that's only because you know, all the excitement and all the energy and all that other stuff was in the, the original video when I made it. So it's an insane theory that I have for whatever the major update is for Disney Dream Night Valley. I don't know if it's going to be an extension of Disney Dream Night Valley. I don't know if it's going to be another DLC, but I have an insane theory. Okay. So in this clip that I'm about to show, is this when I was streaming, I'm going to get the date and I'll let you guys know what day I recorded this, what day I streamed. If you're not following me on Twitch, please follow me on Twitch. I stream on there practically every day. You're missing my content. If you're like, where you been at? That's literally, <laughs> that's literally where I've been. I've been on Twitch please come join me on twitch i would love to see you there oh get to share it with everybody come on mickey let's turn you back normal honey Eat that up. I don't care. Oh, look at that. Oh, so the DLC is done then. Oh, 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 what is this? Oh, <gasps> no, 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 don't, 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 don't get my hopes up. Do. Do not get my hopes up. The fact, okay, there's so much to unpack right there. The fact that they had Maleficent and Hades right there, okay? And who is the daughter of Maleficent and Hades? Malbertha. Does that mean that we're about to have descendants? Imagine. Um, of, of course, yeah, it is a Disney product. I mean, yes, it is Maleficent. Yes, it is Hades. Yes, they're two different people and have two different stories and blah. But to have the mother and the father of Malbertha right there is insane. And you're like teasing me that maybe we're going to get descendants because of the book too. Let me calm down. Okay, so as you can see, I was basically freaking out about possibilities of descendants being put into the game. Now, I don't know <laughs> if this is actually going to be a thing, okay? I don't know if it's going to be a thing, but everyone who knows me knows I love descendants very dearly. And I also love Once Upon a Time. So the idea that they put Maleficent and Hades on the same picture, like, okay, yeah, side note, yes, it's what they're going to do for the next major update, obviously, right? Spoiler warning. I forgot to say spoiler warning. If you haven't watched Descendants 1, 2, or 3, you can watch Descendants 4 too, but mostly 1 through 3. So in the third film, we come to find out that Maleficent and Hades, which were played by Christian Chenoweth, who played Maleficent, and Cheyenne Jackson, who played Hades, both equally legends in the theater sphere. Mal Bertha is the daughter of Maleficent. That's all we knew for the first two films. Then I believe, like I said in the last video, I believe that this book explained how Maleficent and Hades got together or whatever, the secret that they've been holding. Da -da 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 -da. There was this big secret that Maleficent, Hades had Mal. So that's another thing. Spoiler warning, if you haven't finished Eternity Isle, 
Anyway, Maleficent stands alone. Hades also stands alone. But to me, the fact that they had them both in the same picture together was like, oh, that's T. And then the story book made sense because, okay, so for this part, I am not going to add the sound because I'm not trying to get copyrighted by Disney. Let me show you the clip. Once upon a time, long ago, well, not that long ago, blah, 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 whatever. Belle made it, married her beast, the big cake, blah, blah, blah. To me, the fact that here in this clip, you can see Maleficent, Hades, storybook. Maleficent and Hades had Mal, storybook, descendants, ah, it's all coming together. That's how, you know, so you see where I'm going with this, right? That I'm thinking it's an insane theory. I understand. I know it's crazy that because of this, either a Disney Dream My Valley update to to just the main, you know, main thing, obviously possibly going to be either including one or both of them, right? I'm thinking I'm leaning more towards if they only do a Disney Dream My Valley update and no DLC, I'm thinking only Maleficent, right? Will be the main villain of Disney Dream My Valley. Then we have Hades. I feel like Hades will be a part of a DLC or Hades and Maleficent will both be a part of a DLC which would make another spot for us to discover more stuff da, 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 da. if we get descendants i know i'm gonna go crazy like i love descendants so yeah anyway that's basically my insane theory is that i think that descendants is coming to disney dream my valley i know it's an insane theory i know i sound crazy and i was also talking about my house there we go on disney dream my valley i have a whole floor dedicated to descendants and one dedicated to regina from once upon a time i'm also going to do a once upon a time floor or whatever i just love fairy tales and stuff anyway on that one floor i had made outfits based on the core four so we have carlos outfit evie mal and jay and i was also talking about in that video that i think that it would be a wonderful way to honor cameron boyce i wanted to cover it was like an insane theory plus a little bit of an update as we all know the update for this new dream my valley is coming up we're going to get to mon and pumbaa okay i talked about this by the way i hate these uh, these hairs i almost said outfits i like the outfits i don't mind the outfits I did watch one of the creators. They were talking about someone else had just talked about Descendants and alluded to the boots. And this is, it's either red and blue or pink and blue. And I don't know which one it is. If it's red and blue, it could easily represent Evie. If it's pink and blue, it could represent Audrey and or Aurora, which would still be lead to Audrey. Moving on. So on this post, they talk about how when update comes, we're going to go from night to day and then we're going to meet Timon and Pumbaa. This update is going to be on the 9th, October 9th. And they also talked about the backpacks. So on this post, they talk about the backpack craftables. I was also talking about how I thought the backpack would be a Mushu backpack, but you know, this makes more sense and especially Maleficent descendants. Okay. Oh, that brings me back. Oh my gosh. Okay. So this mountain, since we're getting Maleficent and this is another part of my, my theory that I had. So this is like an insane theory part two, except this is more so what I think could happen. If we only get a Dreamlight Valley update with Maleficent, I don't know. I'm pretty sure we'll get a DSE, whatever. Anyway, I really believe and i have honestly been thinking about this for a long time i have been thinking about maleficent coming for a long long time the this mountain that this whoever this is i have been looking at this and i'm like hmm if maleficent is coming what if she's sleeping underneath this rock mind you and i don't have proof but mind you in one of my streams i was doing a doing a whole bunch of quests in eternity isle a long time ago before the update where we got oswald and there was not a bridge right there it was just a whole bunch of water and we couldn't go across it and i was like this is so suspicious this is going to be something i bet this is going to be something i know this is going to be something bam we got oswald it came out that the little the rock formation came out the water and then now we got a bridge and we can cross it and i was right <laughs> When you go into the overlook, okay, when you go up the stairs and you know that there's a little thing that leads you back to this little section right here, then there's that little brick wall, not brick wall, I'm sorry, stone wall that's behind this tree that we can't move. I saw that and I was like, yo, I feel like this is gonna open up. Because mind you, again, I was right about this area right here. I was right about that and I wish I could have, should have recorded that or kept it or whatever. I came up here and I saw that and I was like, this is looking suspicious. This is like a whole bunch of rock that I feel like eventually we'll have to do yet another upgrade to our axe, knock those rocks down, and then this is going to open up something in this area. And this might, I don't know. I don't know. I could be wrong. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I, I feel like I'm right. <laughs> I was right about the first theory about, you know, Eternity Isle. I might be right about the second Eternity Isle theory. I don't know. Circling back to the Disney Dreamlight Valley, Valley theory. <laughs> Jesus. 
So we're getting Maleficent, right? What if she's been under this rock in her sleeping form the whole time? Sleeping dragon f- dragon form on top of that, right? So as we all know, Maleficent can turn into a dragon, which also, spoilers, Mal can turn into a dragon as well. She's half dragon. Well, Fey actually half Fey, half God. I really do feel like that this rock formation is just like encasing Maleficent as a dragon. She's just in there, been sleeping the whole time. And I feel like this mountain will crack and then you'll open up and there'll be a big green and purple light emitting from that. It'll just crack open. A whole dragon scene emerging from the rock and then bam, that's how, I, I don't know. I feel like that's how we're going to get Maleficent. You know, screaming and wailing as a dragon, waking up as a dragon and that's how we're going to get Maleficent. She's just going to pop up uh, out of these rocks and I've been feeling that way for a long time even before they announced that she was coming. Like I really thought that she was just going to be like the big, the biggest bad, like very, very late, right? Apparently not. But hey, Hey, that's fine. I knew we were going to get her, but I'm so excited we are, you know? So if I'm right, we're going to come back to this video and be like, you was right, Shay. Period. That's my second insane theory. So yes, so we got two insane theories muddled with an update. So, oh, speaking of, we're going to be getting this outfit in the update too. There's a girl and boy version. Pumba embrace a new hobby, pottery. And don't worry, this time the clay requirements are minimal. Continue spending time with these two around the valley and unlock their individual friendship awards. Okay, so as you can see, you know, there's the guy, there's a boy version and there's a girl version. So I don't know if these are, it's a combined outfit unlock that you get for these two or if one gives the girl version and one gives the boy version. I don't know. But either way, this is coming with the update and it's coming on Wednesday and I can't wait. I'm so excited to be playing this game again because I honestly have nothing to do. (laughs) I literally have nothing to do. So we got... Simone and Pumba come in. We got the going back into the Lion King room, which is going to be sunlight instead of the dark time. Um, we're going to have new outfits coming. We're going to have five, where's the post? Five unlockable items that come with the two earnable and the snow, a uh, star path. And then I think the rest are going to be craftable unless these are the ones that are craftable, whatever. That's it for me, you guys. Please, 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 please consider subscribing. Please like this video, y'all. This is my second time recording this video. Comment down below. Are you excited? Are you happy? Are you sad? What are you looking forward to? Tell me your thoughts down below about the update and come back. If y'all, if I'm right about this descendants thing, whether we get it now or whether we get it in the future, y'all gonna be able to come back and say, yup, you was right. It might've took a minute. It might've took a couple years, (laughs) but you were right, period. Anyway, let me go. (laughs) Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it so much. Don't forget to like, leave a comment down below. Click the notification button to know when I'm going to be posting next. Follow me on Twitch and I'll see you guys in the next video.